Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome to this Sky Tower defense tutorial. Actually, I have a few things to say this time because it's a bit more complex, and I also found a way out to find better snap points for the railing since that has been a big problem for a lot of people. The net, as you see, is pretty dense. Um, if you build it like that, it will filter off turtles and stickers. If you only build every second railing going down, turtles will fall through the thing and stickers will um, still slide off. So I filled on top of one of my skeleton towers, just going up like a regular sky tower and then going from the highest layer of your, like where your last turrets are, you want to go like a bit higher with your supports. I'm using double door frames over here. And then I extend the double door frames to the left and to the right to cover the whole tower using pillars to give more snap points to the front and the back as well because otherwise you would only be able to snap railings left and right. So talking about the railing placement, um, you either want to use the snap point which is inside of the pillar or the one on top of the pillar, but you always need to use the same snap point, otherwise they will not be lined up as they are in my video. To actually find all the snap points pretty easily, if you start with the same snap point every time, you just need to remember the number which your snap point was, in this example it's number 34 I think. And then if you always start at the same snap point, you can just skip to the number and get it like that very easily. On regular serves, I suggest using a tappy or a ragnata to stay in the air without moving left and right or up and down all the time. Get the snap point in the middle, I'm using quarter walls over here. Sadly, I have not found another snap point where we could line it up perfectly, so I need to step a um, pillar water wall higher and that's why I'm using like the second um, direction of the railing as you see like there's some very steep ones and some which are flatter but at the end they're all coming to the same like height and from there you can make a very plain net at the same level So you can extend it how much you like. I did cover the whole foundation of my tower below. Um, for the backside, you want to do the same thing. Um, every second one is gonna be the flat one, and every other one is gonna be the deeper one. And then they are lined up perfectly, as you see. For the top, I'm um, just extending the first row to the back. You only get the snap point though if you already placed some going down. Um, and it will cover the whole tower so there's no space where shit could um, chill on top and get stuck. Yeah, and basically you need to just finish it for the whole tower. And that's already it for the whole video. Here you see my fucking Lego long throw shit, whatever. In the next one, bye bye.